Hey guys, what's up, what's up? So I'm coming back, it's Marlene. Hey, it feels good to be back, but I'm just so sore. So I wanna do like mini vlogs so that you have some, you know, videos where I'm talking, tell you how I feel and stuff like that because even when I watch this like a year from now, so I wanna know how I felt on this day. Um, So currently doing the 100 miles in 45 days challenge, right? And I got that from a person that I really enjoy watching. His name is Nick Bear. But he did 100 miles in like 50 hours or something crazy like that. So I'm nowhere near his level. But I thought it would be a good challenge just to get me back into like the swing of things. Because like right now, I'm not trying to be the world's fastest, strongest woman. I'm not trying to lose like crazy amounts of weight really fast. I just want to have a routine. Like because like during the, the Rona, okay, like it got to a point where I could just spontaneously wake up in the morning get dressed, put my shoes on, go outside and run for six miles, right? I just, like the way my brain was wired then, I loved it and I miss it. And so I just want to get back to the routine of like waking up and being excited about working out, you know, um, putting my shoes on, you know, just looking forward to that. So that's why I did the 100 miles in 45 days because it comes out to about like 2.23 miles or something like that. So it's not that bad. It really isn't that bad. Now, if you can go faster, then you can get more miles. You can do it quicker than 45 days. But it's enough days, 45 days, enough days to actually get it done. And if you need, like, a rest day, you can have a rest day in that. So I'm liking it so far. It's my third day now. I am sore. Um, my quads are very sore. Last night, I had to sleep on a heating pad, like, belly down on the heating pad so I could put it in front of my quads it felt so good. <laughs> it felt so good. I'm also taking ibuprofen. Okay. I'm taking ibuprofen. Today, um, when I went to Planet Fitness, I forgot that I had the black card from Planet Fitness. So that gives you access to the massage, the hydro massage. It's like a water massage. Oh my gosh. It feels so good. So I did 10 minutes before I started walking. I didn't stretch today, but I did 10 minutes of that. It felt so good, especially when it got down like towards like my hips and my butt, like it felt so good, but it, it felt so good overall. Like it's worth the $25. So if you go to Planet Fitness, upgrade your membership to 25 and get a massage every time you go in there. Like now I'm like, I'm probably gonna just go just to get a massage and nothing else. Oh, I'm bored. Let me go get a little 10 minute massage really quickly, right? So it, just for the massage alone, like it's worth the $25 a month. I'm like, I haven't been going to the gym and they've been charging me. I could have been getting massages. Like, are you kidding me? Um, So here's to that. Um, yeah, today speed was a little faster. Like my body wants to run. Like my brain wants me to run. Um, my brain wants me to run. But the point of this challenge, it's not to run. Like I'm not looking to run. I don't want to run. My body wants to run because I guess it remembers when it used to run like that, but it's not there yet, right? We're not there yet. So I have to force myself not to run. So you're not supposed to run. You're just supposed to walk. Like you just have to walk, right? And don't hold the rails. If you have to hold the rails, bring the speed down, okay? But you're not supposed to run. Do not run. This is not what this is about. This is about forming habits of like going back to the gym, saying you're going to do something, getting it done. And be like, okay, fine. I can live with it. Um, You know what I'm saying? Um, The first day I was so lethargic. I was so tired. The, on Tuesday, all I wanted to do was like sleep all day. I was just so tired. But like yesterday was really good. Today's even better. Like I feel I have more energy. I don't feel tired. Came home, took a shower. I had to go to TJ Maxx and buy some scrubs. Like they have these good scrubs at TJ Maxx. Took a shower and I feel really good. I also, um, I had my braids redone yesterday. Um, I had my ends trimmed. You know, because then it'll be like six months because I'm going till December, like give myself like a solid six months of workout. And in December, I'll do another trim. So this is like the start of something new. And it felt really good to have my ends trimmed because um, even in doing this too, like I take supplements. I do that at night when I take supplements in the morning for some reason and I work out. It feels like I want to throw up like I, I can feel them coming back up. So what I do is I take my supplements at night and when I wake up. I get the benefits of that and I don't have that like nasty feeling because it's really, really uncomfortable. And I also take my supplements with the unsweetened coconut milk. When I take my supplements with water, I don't know, it's really harsh. When I take it with the coconut milk, my throat feels lubricated in a way. I don't know if that makes any sense, but 
it just goes down so much easier and then I digest them so much easier. So I make sure to have unsweetened coconut milk when I take my supplements at at night. Um, yeah, but I feel good. I feel really good. Trying to at least like space 12 hours between the morning workout and at night when I get on the step master. So, you know, today I woke up earlier and I, I was like, I don't know, maybe I want to go back to sleep. I was like, okay, just go Marlene. So I went. So you see, and that's the thing I'm talking about, like trying to just form good habits. So hopefully that's going to be here for long, but hopefully you join me in the challenge, right? It's a walking challenge. It is not running. You know, I'm not in shape. I put all the weight back. Okay. I'm like 217. Girl, I cannot believe it. I was like 280. Like I was like 180 at one point, but I'm back to 217. It's okay. But I'm definitely a lot stronger at this 217 than I was like in 2020. So I thank God for that. My body still remembers lots of things. So that's pretty awesome. But this is a walking challenge. So just walk, right? Just get into that. I just want you to get in the habit, just being consistent just doing it and then once we're done with this then we'll do something a bit more challenging but this is just about walking not feeling stressed not having anxiety right and walking is very easy it's low impact right it doesn't kill so just walking at a nice steady um heartbeat rate and try not to hold the rails okay so that's it for today maybe i'll talk to you guys tomorrow let me know if you enjoy these little talking videos okay so be encouraged um, even though they, you know, it's nice to have a summer body, but I guess we didn't have a summer body. I'm not gonna have a summer body like that, but we can have winter bodies, right? So winter bodies are made in the summer. You know how they say like, oh, they say summer bodies are made in the winter. So I'm gonna say, okay, winter bodies are made in the summer. All right. So let's work on our winter bodies. How about that? So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Okay. Bye. Gotta go.